Hey guys, KSK here. Welcome back to this brand new video. This is the quick overview of Pixel Experience Plus Edition. Now before getting into this video, make sure you click on the subscribe button down below and hit the bell icon to get notified whenever I post a new video. Let's get started. Pixel Experience Plus Edition is a brand new update for many Android devices. It's an advanced version to normal edition, so just like a C and C++. The main goal of Plus Edition is to bring some extra features over the normal edition. We all know the standard Pixel Experience is a minimal custom ROM that offers bare minimum features. Compared to other custom ROMs, Pixel ROM won't let you customize anything according to your fancy. This is where Plus Edition comes to the picture. The Plus Edition brings a few extra features over Normal Edition and provides some minor tools help in customizing the system UI to some extent. So this is the first initial build of Pixel Experience Plus Edition based on Android 10 running on Redmi K20 Pro and Poco F1 and let's find out the new features that it offers over Normal Edition. So starting with number one, screen recorder. Now with the Plus Edition based on Android 10, you can now use a hidden screen recorder inside your system. Now keep in mind to enable the screen recorder, you must need to use ADB shell and type this command to enable the built-in Android 10 screen recorder. Now in order to use it uh, within the power menu, long pressing on the screenshot button invokes the built-in screen recorder. As of now, you can only record the sound from the microphone and there is no option to capture the system audio which is sort of bummer. Hopefully the future builds of Android 10 may bring a more enhancements to the built-in screen recorder framework. Next up, custom screenshots. The Plus Edition lets you take a custom screenshot. From the power menu, you can uh, simply a long press on the screenshot button, just like that. Uh, this will let you select any part of the screen. Just gonna go ahead and select the area that you wanna capture the screenshot. Once it's done, you can confirm it to save the screenshot. Now keep in mind, if in case you have unlocked the built-in screen recorder using ADB command, the long press gesture will invoke the built-in screen recorder instead of taking a custom screenshot. Now to take a full screenshot, you can use the power plus volume button just like that. Now Caffeine is a brand new toggle you get to see in Plus Edition inside the quick toggle section. This allows the user to temporarily disable the screen lock or sleep mode. You can consider it as a shortcut to increase the screen timeout limit. Finally, inside display settings, now you can hide the notch area on devices like Poco F1 and OnePlus 6. Now the Plus Edition also includes a brand new default camera. For instance, on Poco F1, a running Plus Edition comes with the built-in Google camera. Now this is a super stable Gcam 7 and works fine without any issues. Now devices like Redmi K20 Pro comes with a built-in MIUI 11 camera, which is amazing. Now inside system setting, you can enable the full screen gestures that hides the both navigation bar and the pill for a seamless full screen gesture experience. The Plus Edition brings a redesigned system update page where you can find more information about the change log of the current build and OTA software updates. Now lastly, on Redmi K20 Pro, the Plus Edition brings uh, major enhancements to the in-display fingerprint sensor. So this way, you can unlock the phone much faster than ever before. Also, K20 Pro comes with the default brand new improved kernel that delivers the better smooth Android experience. These are some of the new features that are added to the Plus Edition of the Pixel Experience. And lastly, when it comes to performance, older devices like Poco F1 support has improved. This time, developers has tweaked a lot to deliver the much better performance on Poco F1. There is a 0% lag or stutters I have encountered in terms of app animations and transitions. Overall, I would say Pixel ROM Plus Edition is an improved Android 10 custom ROM and is super stable to use it as a daily driver. Hopefully, in future releases, we can expect to see more features that will be added to the system. 
and that's pretty much it uh, this is the quick overview of what's new in pixel experience plus edition if you want to find out the difference between plus edition and normal edition watch my separate video you can find the link to the video in the description box down below so let me know guys what do you think about it in the comments down below give a like comment and subscribe to see more content so thanks for watching this has been ksk ryle peace I can never ever find the right words And there's no way this is real life There's no telling you're the right girl So I can only say that it feels right It feels right, it feels right